so we made it. A lot of people did not park down the street like they were supposed to. That's okay. Now we're here. Let's get in these houses. gorgeous. So this is the 10 squared build. This is the Azal. Walking up, I already just love the tin accents for the roof. And of course, we've got the black windows. Gotta love it. This is pretty cool. I love the Charleston touches that you have the the gas lanterns, right up here. Doors are awesome. Everything is going very modern. Ooh, everybody has good taste in floors, like us. These are awesome. Oh, look at these. These are super cool. Gold pocket doors. It's pretty cool. Nice office. Pretty cool, kind of like I wonder what they put around the fireplace. Oh look. <laughs> That's super cool. Oh my god, this backyard is to die for. The putting green and then it's got a little pool and look at oh my god, the cute little she shed over there. Forget the house. I guess it's just uh, marble. Very cool. Oh, look, it's the giant one of our tree. <laughs> Whoa. kitchen like you don't see anything. This is super neat. Wow. <laughs> Whoa. Oh Mom, there's nothing to eat. Look at these cabinets. These are amazing. Kitchen designers are like, oh, they're figuring everything out. Like, stick all the drawers in here. You don't need all these cabinets way high up. You need a bunch of drawers. And a plug. So you can hide all your phones so it's not all over the countertop. This is really cool. And I like how they changed the pattern on the floor. The sink is so cool. Oops, sorry. Look at this. Look out. It's beautiful. All right, so let's see. What else? Trash can. But this must be, is this the dishwasher? Sure is. Ooh, that's fancy. Oh, it's all lit up. That's nice. You drop your forks all down. All right, 
stay inside the house. Stay on. Oh my God, it's like they have the gym. <laughs> this is fancy. Oh. Okay. So it's where everybody has, like they all want to have the hall tree and it's like you want to have all cute little hooks, but really nothing ever looks as nice as you have it all staged as soon as you start actually living there. It's going to be awful. So it's smart. You just tuck it all away. I like it. Oh, this is freaking amazing. This is so cool. Oh, a second dishwasher, but of course. Now this is a house to throw a luncheon in for sure. Actually have a place where all the people can be, prepping all their things, giant wine fridge. I don't think I'm going to try to open that all the way. Look at this place. This is amazing. Oh my god. Look at these doors. And they got the big heaters out here. This is gorgeous. This is gorgeous. Oh, it is, even has your integrated cup holders. This is super cool. I've never really wanted a pool, but this makes it super nice. This is so cool. The back of the house is really pretty too. This is really pretty. I love this. I don't know, it's gonna be hard to top this house. Well, looky here. This is a very fancy toilet. This is very easy to do picture. I think it has a bidet. It's, it's very dark down there. Yeah. I don't want to add a part of that. Doing some new handles, kind of like with this marble touch. I wonder if we'll see white windows at all. I'm thinking we won't. Ah, oh, this is, oh, how pretty. These are really pretty. This makes you want to like actually do your laundry and not just throw it on your bed or on your dining room table. Oh, okay. So they're doing it right off of the primary, I guess. What the, what is this thing? Oh, it like steams your clothes and it's got, it's Wi-Fi connected. Who needs a Kim Kardashian, uh, closet when you can live in Virginia for a fraction of the cost. That is super cool. Pipe 
Oh, my wire is hanging out. This is so pretty. Look at this, very airy. Oh, this is a very pretty bathroom. I definitely like this. I'm not sure what this color is. It's almost like a, like a, like a mist. It's really pretty. It's very soothing. Makes you think like you're at the ocean. This is very pretty. And I don't usually like these sinks, but I like this a lot. This is really neat. Makes me think of daisies. That's pretty cool. Pretty ceiling. I'm so glad we went with the white floors. They really are nice. These are really nice. movie room and you got your own little patio out here and of course the California lights love them oh my god oh forget the rest of the house found my found my room oh my gosh are these I love it. Oh my God, this is so cute. Child Wonderland. And look, it's got a little mailbox right there. That's cute. Very cute. Oh, that's cute. Isn't that cute? I like this. That little mailbox is so cute. This is so cute. Oh, that's super cute. They put a bunch of whiteboards here. Cute idea. But that's a new take on like clouds on the ceiling. It's like a, a wallpaper, like a tapestry. That's pretty. Pretty. Watch your step. <laughs> this is phenomenal. Nice. Oh, because everybody has to have their photo wall. This is great. This place is like so cool. This is your speakeasy. You have to say the, the password. What's the password? Hammerama. The Great Gatsby. Super cool. This reminds me of like Denver. Oh. Oh, and they even have cool. Oh, look at their pictures. Oh, we were very, we were very daring with our artwork. That's fun. <laughs> I told them to stop taking pictures of me. Yes. Oh, yes. That's so funny. Yes, yes, yes. 
Exactly, exactly. Yeah. It makes me think of like Denver. I was trying to think of what would the what would the you pass would be. Yes. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Cute. This is a really cool, cool house. Oh, look at this. What is this thing? I don't know. Would I actually work out if I had a gym like this? Probably not. I love these steps. I will not make the mistake of trying to step over the other way though. That's fine. Well, so far, it's my favorite. Houses. The Hayden Lee. So there was nothing I could do. Like that's just the way that he does it. He, he the land. Hmm. I definitely like it when they tuck the um, garages back. Gives it some nice dimension. Hey, how are you how doing? Are you doing great. You found the Hayden Lee with RC out? We found it. Oh, I love the kitchen. This is really pretty. Oh, yeah. Quick little uh, tour. Kitchen, butlers, the workspaces, the office and so on. Primaries and up this way. And then additional bedrooms. Really cool loft area. And then a flyer over here on the side. Uh, uh, this one's a three bedroom, 4,200 square foot, but it can be up to about 46 or 45 bedrooms. Wow. Uh, any questions? Uh, happy to help. Matt and Hey, great. Thank you. Hey, how are you doing? Very pretty. So I usually don't like a, a dark kitchen, but this is very cozy. I like how they kind of mix the, the dark with the light. It draws you in. Big giant screen porch, big pretty patios. Okay, so I think we're seeing a new trend. I'll be excited to see them put that in all sorts of normal houses too, not just the showcases. Very cool. I think this one's just the, the more approachable house. Nice big pantry. Designers are getting smart. They know that they need to have all the different shelves, like different sizes to do stuff. And seeing a whole lot of green come back, which is really interesting.
Oh, it's kennel. It's a kennel. They let all the animal crackers out of the zoo uh, cages, but we still have to put our, our animals in some cages every once in a while. You gotta make it pretty though. Yeah. Bathroom. Pretty. I do love these big welcoming foyers. This is real smart that they're doing this. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Has some white windows. We actually got some white windows back again. Don't see my side anymore. The poor white windows. They're getting the axe. The what? Those poor white windows. Oh. They've been getting the axe from everybody. Oh. I do this is pretty. like a tub in a shower, but don't want to go down a lot. Yeah. Just for I me. Mean, for temperature's sake? Yeah, I'd like my shower to be on the Here we go. Another great closet. You mean all of this is not enough space? Okay, so, oh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So they're doing the white on the inside to keep it nice and light, and then the black on the outside to make it look all chic. Pretty. Sorry. I'm in the back of all your videos. <laughs> Okie dokie. Stairs. Probably better to get the all the wiring, all the AC, everything. Nice loft. This is the place you'd want to hang out all the time. Even more so probably than the family room. Oh, I like this how they did that to make it floating. That's a good idea. What is it about making it float that makes it just so much more chic? bedrooms over here with cute little cutout for the kids. Mm -hmm. All right. Great little cubby office. Oh, I have the same notebook. Very nice. I'm gonna run into everyone here. It is nice how they tucked the stairs in here. It's very like a, it's like an old world, world charm, but in a brand new house. Smart. Sorry. I wonder why they made the inside of the gutters green. There's obviously a reason. <laughs> and a big old bathroom. Nice storage. Cool. 
cool stuff. Yeah, I like the steps a lot. We'll turn the steps. Pretty house. Thank you so much. Thanks. Got the third house by Behringer, the Jasper. Behringer tends to have really pretty houses. This definitely makes an impression from the outside. Yeah, this definitely is worth the wait. Oh, cool. Yeah, this is a big house. This one definitely has the most stately feel to it. Like, I feel like I'm gonna... John Hughes movie, living in the suburbs of Chicago. Hey, how y'all doing? Hey! Thank you for coming. Thanks yes, for thank you. The dining room. Yes, this is the new thing. We are definitely going to have a butler's kitchen. Like, oh, look how cute. I know this isn't, you know, part of <laughs> the kitchen, but I love the balloon decor. Okay, it's another, like, really very minimalistic kitchen that it's almost like what room are we in? Got to open up everything. Ooh. Fancy, fancy. Because we always need two refrigerators. I love this. This is really nice. This is like having your little Harry Potter cubby underneath of the steps. It's a garage. This is boring. I oh, love tucking the little things right here. So pretty. Little window. Here, we'll pop over this way and finish it. I like all the underlighting underneath the cabinets. So pretty. Very pretty. Very pretty. It's clean, not real fancy, but I like that they did different things with the brick. Great spot to entertain. They're all ready for an event, I can tell. I think it is green. That's pretty cool. I've never seen that before. I think it's stone, but it's like it, it works it out. It kind of flares out. It's neat. They're pretty. Nice laundry room. I 
I think it was my first, the first one was definitely my favorite though. I think this one has a really stately, impressive outside, but inside's been like, oh, it's nice. Oh, there are two staircases. Okay, cool. The two staircases. Tavern. Pretty little bedroom. I do like that they're still keeping all the craftsman trim around. Just pretty and classic. That's kind of neat. Jack and Jill. Yes, Jack and Jill. Yeah, the floor is like plaid. Yes. I like how they did that. That's kind of neat. What's wrong with this bathroom? There can't be 10 people in it at the same oh, time. What the good. heck? Doing pretty good. Looks like you can squeeze a pair of them in. <laughs> it's, it is kind of one of those houses you yeah. kind of twist and turn. You're like, yeah. where am I at? Oh, you know what? Just keep walking. Just keep on walking. You're going to find yeah. something right. Yeah. I'm on the other staircase. <laughs> just kind of goes on and on. Another room with all sorts of, okay, okay. All right, so this was the Jack and Jill one that we were coming into with the plaid floor. The plaid floor is, that's very cool. I do like that. It's different. the cute little stairs though. We'll go down the little stairs. I do like that. I do like a little hidden stairs. Ooh. Make sure you are 100% sober when you go down these steps. Lord of mercy. But I really do like this. Thank you so much. Bye, thank you. Bye. Bye. Number four, I was really excited about this one because it's folks that are near and dear to me. I love Clay Street Builder. They're so awesome. They did such a great job for some of my clients. I've been really excited about seeing this one. As soon as I walk up to it and just how they set it, they're really good at setting things just right. Um, it just makes me think like, oh, I'm in, at Lake Tahoe with the big old lodge. I love it. I'm not usually drawn to the things that are like a real dark outside, but I like this a lot. This thing is gigantic.
the copper gutters and the copper pipes, those are very cool. Yep. Oh, very pretty. Very pretty. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Very pretty. I knew they'd have beams. They'd love to use their beams and they always do such a great job. Yeah, this is really pretty. There's another one. So that's the second one where it comes out like this. That's really neat. I didn't think I would, I would never think of that, but. Real pretty. I love their outside space. Nice. Oh, it's got like the easy breeze on one side. Oh, okay, that's exactly what it is. All of it's easy breeze. They're getting really clever with these things. So it doesn't look so plasticky. It doesn't look like it at all. Nice outside space, real pretty. Ooh. Excuse me. Really nice. It integrates that screen porch into the house nicely. Just kind of melts into it. Love the big tall doors and windows. Very nice, cozy. Very pretty, very welcoming. Another cute little butler pantry, lots of green. Mm -hmm. The tall doors just make everything, it's tall ceilings anyways, but the tall doors already just make it. Everything just lift up. Lots of built-ins kind of melts into things. Nice bedrooms, keep them with the big chunky trim. High ceilings, pretty. Big giant closet, so making use of all the space. And we just, they went more traditional. We put some cool hooks on it. But I definitely love having the little wet bars, little coffee bars, whatever you want to do it. Let's go up. Excuse me. Gotcha. The cool frog. The man cave. Big giant hokey. Definitely seems it, it fits with the outside. Feeling kind of large. All right, so we've been down here already. I think it's the other side that we're going to.
pretty airy laundry room. I definitely like, I like the bright and light laundry rooms. That's the gig. Seeing this a lot, uh, another one of these things. And that thing's so bad that I don't want to break something. Pretty closets. I'm stepping off the laundry room again. That is obviously the thing. Love the beams. Anything we can do to put beams in it, it's going to be beautiful. I like that they have the lighting in the cabinets. More beams. Yeah, it's just a very, like a cool place at Lake Tahoe. them so far this one like the outside and the inside match each other the best like I was I was expecting more rustic more natural We are rounding it out to the fifth house by Monaco Homes, and it's the Airy. Going back very modern. Now, right off the bat, I'm looking at it. I don't think I've ever seen a brick on the outside where they did the, I think it's a herringbone. That's very different. It's very different. It's very cool. I definitely like how uh, which one was it? Um, 10 squared and Monaco. They did their retaining walls. They definitely made them very nice. Part of the architecture gives it a very like uh, stately feel. These are great. I uh, love all the stained concrete they've been doing. So pretty. Lanterns are really pretty. I love a white brick. I think that's just what it is. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome oh, to Monaco Homes. Hi. I ran out of flyers, but I'll give you um, my little spiel. So this is our first home here in Vinatera. Okay. We have another one in the back of the neighborhood as well. Okay. Um, we mostly do spec homes, but we can build custom, and we do pretty much anywhere in the RBA area. Okay. So, Great. Hope you enjoy. These are two of our builders here, Humberto and Johnny. Hi. Um, let us know if you have any questions. Okay. Great. Well, I love the foyer. It's just like yeah. light and welcoming. Beautiful and and wine as soon as you walk in the door. Very neat. I definitely love the places that they do the the lighter floors. That just makes it feel nice and modern. Fresh and contemporary. Oops, sorry. It's like um, those little plastic cups you get when you camp. You know? There you go. The ones that like you collapse down. Pretty. Real pretty. I love that it's just like you feel like you're outside. Now that is smart. I think they should do that in bedrooms more, that it just makes you feel like you're outside. You're pretty. Oh, you're right. You're right. Sorry. Oh my goodness. Oh, my friend was telling me about that. 
Oh, really? Yeah. And that's the glass or the glass has the bracelet. Definitely a statement piece. Definitely my favorite, that it just makes you feel like you melt into the wood. <laughs> nice outside space. I really hope that in general, for all homes that they start adding, um, even just covered porches, you don't even have to do the screens on it. People like it so much more than a deck. You just stick a little bit of patio, is it stamped, like a stamped concrete or something like that? Good stuff, hardy. Yeah, I think that should be just kind of the standard. Everybody loves it, just do it. Now, I will definitely say I don't think I've ever seen a sink this color, but I kind of like it. A lot of, I guess, quartz, marble, all that stuff in here. Mm-hmm. This is a super cool touch, having the wine cellar right here. Yep. <laughs> this is how you get realtors to your home. <laughs> I think that this is the kind of foyer that my dad would appreciate. This is like his his garage. I mean, it's like, ah, it's lit up. And I always want more light on. It must be a lot of light because I'm like, ah. Cute little bedrooms. Fun and feminine. Now this is a TV room. Super cool. What a cool idea. The same outfit as me. That was me. Great idea with kids. Great idea. Wow. All right, we got a little secret passageway. Woohoo! Oh, this is so cool. Definitely like the little secret hidden door. Great idea. Mm -hmm. The 
cool hidden bookcase. Wow, it's a lot of light. You did a great job. <laughs> did a great job. All these rails that you can see are all wrong handmade or installed here and welded here on site. That's amazing. This will wake you up. If you're not awake, yeah. boom. <laughs> it will wake you up. Like, my gosh. Thank you so much. Take care. Take care. So really neat houses. Very different from the ones in the spring. I guess it's definitely, they're all like very much in keeping with what the feel out at Vinatera is. And it is more, um, it's just more rustic. It's more rustic. 